Almost every form of music can be adapted for the drum corps idiom, with the exception of, of some very contemporary compositions that use a lot of electronics and synthesized sounds. Jay Kennedy is an award-winning arranger composer of TV commercial jingles. If you think you've never heard his work, listen. He and his partner have won two Clio Awards, advertising's top honor for TV commercials. He even composed the title music for the opening of this broadcast. Twenty years ago, Jay Kennedy was a member of the Kilties Drum Corps of Racine, Wisconsin. He has a master's degree in music and has used his classical training and experience to become a highly respected DCI judge. Probably the most challenging for any arranger is to take classical or symphonic literature and transfer that into the drum corps idiom. Primarily because in drum corps, you only have two basic groups of sounds, one being the brass and the other being percussion. Whereas in classical symphonic literature, you have five groups of sounds. The first being woodwinds, uh, flutes, oboes, bassoons, clarinets. The second being brass. The third being the strings. And the fourth being percussion. And the fifth being what I call others, celeste, harp, piano, sometimes saxophone. In 1987, the Garfield Cadets chose Appalachian Spring by Aaron Copeland and transcribes that into the drum corps idiom. The problem that faced them was that Appalachian Spring primarily is a string feature uh, in the classical idiom, and they had to transfer that into the brass and percussion. So the problem there was taking the strings and sometimes woodwinds uh, and occasionally brass and transferring that into the two groups of sounds in drum corps. For me personally, one of the biggest charges and excitements I would get is if a, a drum corps took a piece of music that I've written and performed it in the drum corps idiom. I don't know how other composers feel, but if a drum corps did a Levi's 501 blues commercial or a Prudential Insurance, uh, although I wouldn't be able to judge it, I would get the biggest thrill out of that, uh, probably one of the biggest thrills of my life, because I love the activity and I love what the corps are doing, and so you combine those two and it couldn't get any better for me.